So we're on the home screen. What do we do if we want to add some income? Well, no surprise, we can go to the plus or we can go to the income tab. There's nothing there at this stage. We'll choose the plus and then you're going to think, well, obviously I want to create an invoice. And if you do that, this takes you into the option where you can subscribe to Zero for $4.99 a month if you want invoice and with one month free. At this stage, let's not do that. We will look at that in a later video, but let's go back and say, okay, if we're not signing up to $4.99 a month, what else can we do? Well, we can still say plus, and this time we can choose income rather than an invoice, and we can fill in invoice details. So we've got an invoice, we've got the value, 105, the type of income, we've only got two choices here. We'll say it's sales, What's the date? Let's say it was the 22nd of July. Description. Just going to say gardening. Who was it for? We don't have a contact at this stage. It's for Adam Ross. Add an email address if we were going to email invoices later. At this stage, I'm just going to leave that and say save. So we can attach a file and choose it from my photos and add. So let's save. Okay, so let's add another lot of income. So this time I want to make some profit. So I'll say 300 pound type of income. It's going to be sales. Today will be fine. And then I'm going to say sales summary for July, 2022. Who is it from? And I'm just going to say all customers. So you can see what I'm doing here. I'm adding sales in bulk. Now, well, obviously we need to think about this when making tax digital comes on board. This might not be something that you can do, but I'm going to do that for now. And I'm going to go back to my home screen. So now I can see that for the month of July, I've got a profit, I've got income of 405 and expenses of 175. 